Tanks are some of the most iconic and powerful military vehicles ever built. But just how far have they come? What are the largest tanks ever constructed by military engineers? And were they worth the effort? Well, in this video, we'll find out together, exploring the top 10 biggest tanks in history. From the most modern and advanced machines of today to the toughest vehicles of World War II, these tanks literally push the boundaries of physics. But what do you think is the biggest tank ever built? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And now, let's start this journey through the pinnacle of military engineering. Number 10. K-2 Black Panther The K-2 Black Panther is a modern main battle tank developed for South Korea, entering service in 2014 after a decade of development. Designed to respond quickly to threats, particularly from North Korea, it emphasizes mobility and striking power. The tank features a 120mm L55 smoothbore gun and is powered by a Tognum MT833 diesel engine allowing it to reach speeds of up to 42 miles per hour on flat terrain. Its advanced fire control system enables targeting and firing at enemies up to 6 miles away. With cutting-edge network features for information sharing, the K2 Black Panther stands as one of the most expensive tanks globally, costing around $8.5 million although it shares similarities with the M1 Abrams due to South Korea's close ties with the US, it is notably lighter, weighing just 55 tons, and incorporates modular composite and explosive reactive armor for enhanced protection. Number 9. M103 Heavy Tank The M103, a notable predecessor to the M1 Abrams, served in the U.S. military from 1957 to 1974. Unlike its more modern counterparts, the M103 was designed during an era when heavy tanks were valued for their superior firepower and robust armor. Weighing 62 tons, it was both longer and wider than the M1 Abrams. The tank was equipped with a formidable 110mm M58 main gun and up to 5 inches of steel armor at the front, enhancing its battlefield durability. Despite its impressive specifications, the M103 had limitations. Its top speed was only 21 miles per hour, and it had a range of less than 100 miles. While it never saw active combat, the M103's design reflected the era's emphasis on heavily armored, powerful tanks, though it was eventually replaced by more advanced and maneuverable designs like the M1 Abrams. Number 8. Leopard 2 The Leopard 2 is a premier main battle tank developed in Germany, first introduced in 1979. It has become a mainstay for numerous military forces worldwide, with over 3,600 units produced. As Germany's counterpart to the Challenger 2 and M1 Abrams, the Leopard 2 stands out for its advanced technology, versatility, and maneuverability with newer models costing around $30 million each. The Leopard 2 is equipped with a powerful 120-20mm main cannon and two 7.62mm machine guns, powered by a 1500 horsepower engine that enables speeds of up to 42 miles per hour. Its armor is designed for durability, featuring modular layers of hardened steel, tungsten, and titanium to resist direct hits. The standard Leopard 2A7V weighs approximately 64.5 tons, while the latest variant, the Leopard 2A8, will have a weight ranging between 65 and 67 tons. Number 7. Tiger II The Tiger II, also known as the King Tiger, was a formidable German heavy tank introduced in 1944 as a successor to the Tiger I. Despite an initial order for over 1,500 units, fewer than 500 were built due to Allied bombing raids disrupting production facilities. Weighing in at 68 tons, 
The Tiger II was significantly heavier than its predecessor, largely because of its powerful 80E mm K43 main gun and 6-inch thick armor, designed to withstand heavy enemy fire. The tank featured improved mobility and sloping armor, enhancing its effectiveness on the battlefield. Its 80 ED Lelimit gun had a range of around 6 miles and could effectively engage enemy tanks. The Tiger II saw notable action during the Normandy landings and was considered one of the most deadly tanks of its time. Number 6. M1 Abrams the M1 Abrams is a renowned American main battle tank that has served as a cornerstone of U.S. armored forces since its introduction in 1980. Named after General Crichton W. Abrams, this tank has proven highly effective and has been produced in approximately 10,000 units. The M1 Abrams has seen extensive action in conflicts such as those in Iraq, Afghanistan, and Yemen, and is also used by countries including Australia, Egypt, and Saudi Arabia. Weighing 71.2 tons, the M1 Abrams is one of the heaviest and most expensive tanks, with each unit costing over $10 million. The latest version, the M1A2 SEP Abrams, features a 120 mm L44 M256 smoothbore gun and a 1500 horsepower engine, allowing it to reach speeds of up to 42 miles per hour. It also incorporates advanced defensive measures, including graphite-coated armor and the Trophy Active Protection System. Number 5. Challenger 2. The Challenger 2 is a highly reliable and versatile main battle tank, introduced by the UK in 1994 as a response to tanks like the M1 Abrams and Leopard 2. Serving as a key asset for the British Army, as well as in Oman and Ukraine, the Challenger II has earned a reputation for durability and effectiveness. Its innovative Dorchester II armor offers significant protection against anti-tank weapons, while its main armament, the 120mm L30 rifled gun, ensures strong offensive capability. Additionally, it is equipped with two 7.62mm chain guns for defense against infantry. Costing around $5 million each, the Challenger II can reach speeds of up to 37 miles per hour and requires a crew of four. Although the standard model weighs about 64 tons, optional armor modules can increase its weight to 75 tons for enhanced protection. Number 4. Char 2C the Char 2C, a French super-heavy tank from the interwar period, embodies the ambition to create an imposing vehicle that was both larger and heavier than its contemporaries. Designed during World War I and entering service in 1921, the Char 2C was intended to be a formidable machine of war, but it saw limited action and was ultimately destroyed by the French themselves during World War II to prevent capture by Nazi Germany. Weighing between 69 and 77 tons, the Char 2C holds the distinction of being the heaviest operational tank of its time, though it was more a symbol of national pride and propaganda than a practical combat vehicle. With a length of over 33 feet and requiring a crew of 12, it was a massive and unwieldy machine. While its weight and size were impressive, the Char 2C's limited mobility and heavy construction highlighted the technological constraints of its era. Number 3. Tortoise Heavy Assault Tank The Tortoise Heavy Assault Tank was a British design developed during World War II to address the challenge of penetrating heavily fortified German positions like the Atlantic Wall and Siegfried Line. Though production began towards the end of the war, only six units were completed, and the tank never saw active combat due to the war's conclusion and the shift to newer designs. Weighing an imposing 79 tons, the tortoise was built with armor up to 9 inches thick to withstand heavy enemy fire. It was armed with an Ordnance QF 32-pounder 94mm gun, which was powerful enough to breach German tanks, 
along with several machine gun turrets for additional firepower. Despite its formidable protection and firepower, the tank's immense weight limited its mobility, restricting it to a top speed of just 12 miles per hour. Number 2. T-28 Super Heavy Tank The T-28 Super Heavy Tank was the United States' answer to the need for a formidable vehicle capable of breaching heavily fortified positions similar to the British Tortoise. Designed in 1944 and with production starting in 1945, the T-28 was intended to tackle defenses like the Siegfried Line, but it was rendered obsolete before it could see combat due to the successful Allied invasion of Europe. This massive tank weighed an astounding 95 tons, making it the heaviest tank ever built by the U.S. Army at the time. It was over 36 feet long and nearly 15 feet wide, and its armor could reach up to 12 inches in thickness. The T-28 was armed with a powerful 105mm T-5E1 gun, which had a muzzle velocity of 3,500 feet per second, providing substantial firepower. Despite its impressive specifications, the T-28 had a top speed of only 8 miles per hour and was difficult to transport, which contributed to the decision to cancel further production. Number 1. Panzer VIII Maus The Panzer VIII stands as the largest and heaviest tank ever built, with a staggering weight of 188 tons, almost double that of the next heaviest tanks. Development began in 1941, driven by Hitler's desire to create a tank that would surpass all others in size and firepower. The Maus entered production in 1944, but never saw combat. Only two prototypes of the Maus were completed, and of those, only one had a functional gun turret. As Allied and Soviet forces advanced into Germany, the Maus was primarily used for testing. Soviet troops captured both prototypes just three weeks before Germany's surrender. The Maus was equipped with a formidable 128 Quadibade K-44 gun L-55, a powerful anti-tank weapon capable of destroying any contemporary armored vehicle. Its armor ranged from 6 to 9 inches thick, contributing to its immense weight. And there you have it, folks. These were the 10 largest tanks ever built in history. From the colossal Panzer VIII Maus to the modern Leopard II, we've explored some of the most impressive and massive machines ever built. Do you agree with this list, or would you include some other machine? Write the name in the comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and until next time, stay safe and always stay curious.